Hello friends, this is Sanu from TechAcid. In today's video, we are going to discuss why I bought the Lumix G85. I bought this camera for four simple reasons. One, it was the uh, affordable camera which had 4K recording. In fact, unlimited 4K recording. The second most important factor that I considered while buying this camera was that it had in-body image stabilization, which is otherwise called as IBIS. So when I was searching the cameras which were under, under $500, there weren't any brand similar to Panasonic or maybe Olympus who gave IBIS or the in-body in image stabilization with respect to their mirrorless cameras. So the obvious choice was Panasonic Lumix G85 which comes under the budget with the kit lens and the third important reason was that it needed to be a vlogging camera. I needed it a fully articulating screen with which I can see myself while recording a video. Fourth reason it also needed to have an external microphone input. So all these parameters led me to this Panasonic Lumix G85. So let's begin the vlogging test. Huh? So I'm walking and uh, you could see that and uh, you could check how stabilized this video is. Despite being a microphone sensor camera body, this Lumix G85 records 4K videos with uh, image stabilization on and it does have a crop in uh, 4K video but it gives you an unlimited recording and it doesn't overheat this camera does have some problems uh, it doesn't uh, have that perfect autofocus so when you look at uh, canon and sony cameras they have very good autofocus for videos as for videos as well as for vlogging but they don't have the in-body image stabilization so so i could live with this autofocus with panasonic so for the for the price that i pay what I'm getting is really awesome. If I had not bought this Lumix G85, I would have bought the Canon 200D Mark II, which is a DSLR, or the Canon M50 Mark II. Both those cameras have only digital stabilization. So I'm currently using a Olympus 12mm f2.0 lens for recording this video. And uh, so I wanted my background to be a little blurred. So I'm using this uh, faster lens, f2.0, which is a bit costly. And, uh, if you use uh, the uh, inbuilt kit lens for this camera, the vlogging would, the stabilization would be even better. So if you use the kit lens, uh, the depth of field or the background blur will, will not be there. So if you are looking out for getting a camera that is capable of recording 4K video with, with inbuilt body stabilization and that, that records unlimited uh, 4K recording and which is almost equivalent to a hybrid camera. So this is the right one for you. I think this is one of the best budget camera for beginners who are into video making. I hope there are a few people who might get a solution with this video. With this, I wrap up today's video. Let's meet in the next video. Until then, this is Anup signing off. Bye-bye.